Lisa, a highly anticipated member of Blackpink in the K-pop industry, recently surprised everyone with her performance at Crazy Horse Paris, while her decision to perform at the famous nightclub known for its nude art shows sparked controversy. Woody Millendichinder, a Thai TV host and devoted Lisa fan who feels like family, provided a positive perspective that changed many people's perceptions about Lisa's appearance at Crazy Horse. Woody, who attended the event from the back rows alongside fans and Lisa's mother, noted that Lisa's decision to do this was not due to external pressure but purely based on her own desire. Lisa, who is a big fan of Crazy Horse, saw this as a personal challenge and an opportunity to push the boundaries of her artistic expression. Crazy Horse Paris, a renowned institution in Paris, is known for its sensuous and joyful art without crossing certain boundaries. At the age of 26, Lisa felt it was the right time to take on this challenge. Her courage and balanced maturity were the main reasons why she decided to join Crazy Horse. Lisa's achievement at Crazy Horse immediately captured the world's attention, often regarded as a goodwill ambassador for Thailand. She is now seen as a global force in the entertainment world. Her performance revitalized Crazy Horse Paris and reached a new global audience overnight. From now on, anyone visiting Paris would surely want to witness a show once graced by Lisa. Woody began to narrate, the performance began with Lisa emerging from behind the curtains, creating excitement among the audience before disappearing again. The curtains then opened, revealing the meticulously choreographed dances of Crazy Horse. They gradually revealed themselves, maintaining a sense of mystery while showcasing their upper bodies. Lisa appeared in several scenes, but was never fully visible, keeping the audience intrigued. At times, she wore costumes without veils, challenging conventional expectations of Crazy Horse performances. Each set had unique costumes and choreography, Lisa's diversity was reflected as she smoothly transitioned between different styles, the lighting, colors, and sound were creatively crafted, immersing the audience in the art. For those unfamiliar with this type of performance, they were in for a surprising experience. The emphasis was not only on open sensuality but also on the multidimensional aspects of the show. One standout performance was Crisis What Crisis, where Lisa portrayed a stock trader. She started with layers of clothing and gradually removed them, revealing an extraordinary set of lingerie. It was a captivating and sexy look, in line with Lisa's signature style. In this set, she was not just a performer, her vocal prowess was also remarkable, even surpassing her Blackpink concerts. Fans in attendance had a rare opportunity to see Lisa step outside her comfort zone, proving she can tackle any challenge. Lisa's performance at Crazy Horse Paris concluded with bows and applause from the audience. The curtains closed but not for long, they reopened, allowing the dancers to thank the audience once more. During this moment, Lisa spotted someone unexpected among the audience. She smiled and acknowledged their presence. It turned out to be Jenny, Lisa's fellow Blackpink group member. No matter how loud the cheers were from the crowd, they couldn't match the enthusiastic cheers from Lisa's mother, who was ecstatic to see her daughter perform. Her joy was palpable, and she even whispered at the end, I think this could be sexier. Lisa's performance at Crazy Horse Paris has proven that she is a bold and talented artist who can take on any challenge. With her outstanding achievements, Lisa has changed many people's perceptions of Crazy Horse Paris and erotic art as a whole. Many reviews also state that Lisa's performance, particularly her stage, was not vulgar. The importance here is that before criticizing, you should come and see for yourself, or you are not invited, haha. <laughs>